guys, this is Miss Anna, and I'm the STEM coordinator over at the Davis Boys and Girls Club. Today, we are back in my kitchen to be celebrating Eat Better, Eat Together Month. Did you know that research has shown that eating a meal together with your family is not only delicious, but it also can lead to a lot of amazing benefits? Scientists have found that families that take the time to spend at least one meal together a week are more likely to choose healthier food and also have strengthened relationships. In today's video, in celebration of Eat Better, Eat Together Month, I'm going to tell you why you should make your salad a rainbow and also teach you how to make a simple salad dressing to go with your rainbow salad. Did you know that nutritionists recommend that you include as many colors as possible in your salads? This is because the different colors of vegetables actually indicate that they have different nutrients inside of them. Red vegetables such as tomatoes, radishes, red bell peppers, and red onions, to name a few, include the nutrients lycopene, vitamin A, and vitamin C, in addition to some other nutrients. These nutrients can actually help reduce the risk of some cancers, lower blood pressure, reduce cholesterol, and support joint tissue in people with arthritis. Orange and yellow vegetables such as sweet potatoes, orange bell peppers, yellow bell peppers, and carrots contain alpha and beta carotene and vitamin A. These nutrients can help reduce the risk of some cancers, lower cholesterol and blood pressure, and work with magnesium and calcium to build healthy bones. Dark green vegetables such as chard, broccoli, bok choy, and Brussels sprouts, to name a few, contain some of the nutrients such as vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin K, magnesium, iron, and calcium. These nutrients can reduce cancer risk, lower blood pressure and cholesterol levels, and help with your eye health and vision. Blue and purple vegetables such as eggplant, turnip, purple cauliflower, and purple cabbage can contain potassium, calcium, vitamin A, and vitamin K. These nutrients can help support eye health, lower cholesterol, boost your immune system, and support healthy digestion, to name a few benefits. Once you've built your salad using fruits and vegetables of different colors, you can make this simple salad dressing that can also show us some chemical properties to go along with it. To make this vinaigrette, you will need vinegar, I'm using apple cider vinegar, oil, I'm using olive oil, and mustard. First, I'm going to take half of a cup of oil and I'm going to pour it into the jar I will be making my salad dressing in. I'm using a mason jar just so you guys can see what I'm doing. And it's clear, but you could also use a plastic container or a bowl and use a whisk to mix it. So, now that I have my oil in the jar, I'm going to add two tablespoons of vinegar into the jar as well. And I'm going to close my jar. Once I have the jar closed, if you look very closely, you can actually see that the oil is on the top of the jar and the vinegar is all on the bottom. So when I first put them in, they don't mix. What do you think is going to happen when I shake the oil and the vinegar together? Will they mix? Let's find out. If you are doing the salad dressing in a container where you are going to shake it together instead of stirring it, you need to make sure that the lid is on very tightly before you start shaking it. But now that mine is, I'm going to shake my dressing. Now that I shook my oil and vinegar together, we need to check if it mixed. Now on my camera with this lighting, it might be hard to tell, but if I get a brighter light, we might be able to tell that there are little 
tiny particles of the vinegar, especially on the bottom, that have not mixed. And that is because oil and vinegar actually cannot mix. Oil has molecules in it that actually are repelled by water, which is one of the ingredients in vinegar. So when we try to mix the oil and vinegar together, they're not actually going to mix. How we can achieve them mixing together is by adding something called an emulsifier. An emulsifier actually helps oil and water products such as vinegar mix together. Our emulsifier that we are going to use is mustard. So now I'm going to add one tablespoon of mustard to my salad dressing and see if I notice a difference. I'm going to mix my salad dressing together again to mix the mustard in with the oil and vinegar. Once I have shaken it around, I'm going to stop and observe what I see. Does it look the same as before or does it look different? If you are doing this at home, you're going to notice that there are no longer different layers for the oil and the vinegar and that it should be one mixture that looks the same throughout the entire container. That is because the mustard acts as an emulsifier which helps the oil and vinegar mix together. So now that we've made our rainbow salads and some dressing to go along with them, you need to get the people together that you are going to celebrate Eat Better, Eat Together month with. Plan a meal at least once a week where you guys are all able to sit down together and enjoy each other's company. Make sure everyone puts their phones away and spend time with the people you care about and also share a delicious meal together.